Welcome back everyone to another episode of Dynasty Warriors 8 Star Guide. This time we'll be doing the Battle of Wan Castle for the Wei Army. Um, before I actually start, the second star there failed to rescue Cao Ang and Cao Min. Um, I'm not really going to cover that. All I'm just going to say is just let them die and you'll, you'll automatically get that star easily. I'll just be covering the other two stars where you save them and you help Dian Wei survive and enable them to appear. So simply, let's start, let's begin. And the best way to keep someone alive is to play as the character. So we're going to be playing as Dion Wei right now. <clears throat> well, not the best way, but the the safest way, I would say. So we're actually going to play as Dion Wei. Let's make sure he's got some good weapons on him. That looks good. Let's put, a, put another one on him. There you go. Equip skills. He's good to go. Let's get this battle going. Um, pretty much you want to kill every single general here. As soon as you get... Uh, as soon as you get the option to uh, save those two generals, save them. As soon as the doors are open, just run in, save them. It'll be simple. We'll skip this video. So let's get in here. Let's destroy Huchi Ear. <laughs> Huchid? I don't even know how to describe that, how to pronounce that name. But destroy them. And destroy these little unit commanders too, because they're going to be. You're going to want to destroy them as well. If you want to ride on your horse, feel free to do so. I might actually do it. I don't know. I could use a horse. I've done this stage with Sao Tsao, but to make it a little simpler, I think it would be best to use uh, to use Dion Way to be safe. Let's continue forward. There's a bunch of ballistas here. There we go. Eliminate those. Get rid of that guy. We should be ambushed in one of these rooms. Not this one. There's another room. I think the next area we'll get ambushed in. And this room, a little weird. If you can master the uh, jump attack. Let's see. Let's see if we can master his jump attack. Probably not right now, but... Alright, he's dead. <clears throat> But if you can get good with the uh, jump attack, you'll hit it. And if you're not going to be good like I'm doing right now, you'll get knocked over to the side. So if you just want to be safe, just walk up to it and just give it a good whack. I don't know, sometimes I can get the, the jump attack to work very well. Other times it just blows balls. I, I don't know, I really don't understand why it does that. There we go. But the, the jumping attack is way faster, just, I don't know, it just messes up sometimes. <clears throat> Here we go. Look at that, I'm not even near the thing. There we go, just play it safe. Okay, boom! There we go. We managed to do quite well there. We're going to get ambushed here by about three or four uh, generals. And then after this, we can start rushing through the stage and save those two generals. As soon as you run up to them and save them, their health will regen. So, it'll look pretty good for us. There we go. Let's just start chopping everyone down the size. There's another general over here. Just defeat all these generals. I don't really know if you really need to, but to be safe and ensure your safety, I like to defeat them. And this gate over here will open to your side, and then you can go down here. There'll be some Arbalists. You can run pretty much right past them and kill the general in here. Once you kill this guy, they'll stop working. Alright, there's some in here as well, so... Boom, boom, yeah! Bam, bam! Alright, this room is pretty much slaughtered. Just continue, and I don't know why they're still hitting me. I guess it hasn't uh, registered yet that he's dead. This room could be a little tricky. I mean, it, it really depends. I don't suggest being on your horse for this. The wind is, like, blowing constantly. It's a little weird. Look at all of these tracks. Uh, it's easier to walk through it. If you're, on, if you're on the horse, it pushes you so much more. And pretty much once you make it, that's it. You're home free. It's just that little portion right there that pushes you. And right here, we're going to be able to save Cao Ong and the other dude. As soon as we break through this gate, 
my horse is too far away, he's like in the water or something. Let's just keep moving forward. See if I can get my horse to give me a hand here, man. Let's keep on going. Come on, baby, come on. There we go, Castle Gate. Leave the Castle Gate alone for a second. You want to get over here and help your two generals. And just go straight to the first one. There we go. And his health should regen. There we go. Bam! Health regen as soon as you got in. He was about to die, too. And run straight to the next dude. You can use your Musu if you want to. I don't. I, I really don't choose to. I think we have more than enough time to save him. Like, look how low his health is. It's about half. So he's good. As soon as you save him, he'll be free to go. He'll start following you, and we can just continue and get out of this place. Just destroy all these little generals. Any little general that's followed you in here, make sure you kill them. Who is next? Another general right here, and then we'll go out, we'll open the main gate, and we'll continue. There we go. And we'll go out here, destroy this one as well. And just because I can, I will destroy this. Because they annoy me. If I can destroy it, jeez. And South Tell is out here getting beat up a little bit. No matter, we can destroy this guy. Go outside and a video should play as soon as you come outside of uh, of your homies and stuff. There you go. And this video, you're not going to be able to stop the arrows hitting you. The arrows will always hit you. But if you played this correctly, like what we just did in here, kill everyone in here correctly, you'll be fine and he will not die at the ending of the stage. <clears throat> he'll get his grace from Cao Cao and... And he'll live, he'll be there for another two stages, which is awesome. Boom! Get ripped. Dion Wei. And... <clears throat> Dion Wei's a little bit hurt, but he's gonna make it. Bam! He just rips everything out. This is nothing. And this happens regardless, no matter what you do. We've killed every general inside, so we're good to go. So just kill every general out here, and we'll continue to move. By anything. And it looks like... Looks like he's not even hurt anymore, you see that? What a beast. b b b, -b beast And now we can continue on with the stage. Keep defeating generals. And now we just cross the bridge. Let's go. We shall determine the outcome of this battle in another time. Farewell. And as soon as you cross the bridge, you want to kill these generals here just to help your team out. Just to help with your army's progression. Okay. And there'll be another little baby general in here to defeat. Just kill him just so your team can have it a little easier. There we go. And what you want to do is take over these three bases over here on the left. Just in preparation, just get ready for them. There we go. Now just wait in here for the ambush to come out. There we go. Alright, he's done. Now you go move on to the next one. Make sure you defeat all three of them while Goji is doing his plan. You can speed up the events a little bit. So here's the next event. Here's the next person that's going to spawn in here. Here we go. They should spawn here in a second. <clears throat> here we go. Chop them up. Chop, chop. Go to the next base. What? The enemy. But, our main force isn't here yet. but they're not here yet. Don't worry about it, buddy. And now, what you simply wait for is for the timeline to fulfill itself and for generals to get inside these bases and start hiding inside of them. Defeat all these little punks. 
There we go. No, I am not an ordinary fighter. Bam! Missed that attack, baby. And now what you're waiting for is these three generals over here to get inside these bases. So pretty much you're waiting for the events and you're just... You're waiting on these three losers over here to get into position. And you'll see the guys right here. These guys all on the bridge right here. These are the three that we need to get inside each base. One in each base. So while they're getting in position, I guess we could help our guys over here. Kill some, some dudes in here. Should be a little... General, I don't know, one of these little guys. There we go. And Kao Hong's gotten into the first base, as you've seen. And we're gonna watch the second guy get into the second base and then disappear and hide. Sao Chun. Alright, get in there, buddy. He's gonna go into the base. Disappear. And then this third guy, he's gonna walk all the way around, go inside the base, disappear as well inside this base. Bam, and it's gonna say reinforcements are coming. They're gonna want to rush you be like hurry up hurry And we're just gonna sit here and wait for the enemy to come out. Keep your men hidden Wait for the ambush to pop out and then let's crush them Actually, you could crush them right now if you wanted to because they're already fighting our generals. So let's get over here Open the gates you're gonna let the timeline catch up with itself the timeline isn't up to where, where we are right now. They don't realize that we've already ambushed them. So there we go. There we go. Another person down. Should be one more general inside here. Here we go. Boom. Done. And now, our only mission now is to just finish the stage. And in the ending video, if you guys did it properly, Dion Wei will not die. He'll just look embarrassed. <laughs> when they say that he's great, he's like a legendary warrior, and he'll just look embarrassed, and that'll be that. You don't have to worry about anything else. Hey, you're really doing well out there. Now, if you get the video that uh, Dion Wei dies at the ending, there's possibly a, a possible chance that you missed one of these steps. So be sure not to miss any of these steps. Make sure you kill every general in the base. Alright, this guy is out for the count. Now we're going to go move forward. I'll grab his stuff. There's no rush now. but And a little reinforcements are going to pop out in here. But it doesn't matter. You can end the stage now and be good to go. Arbalist been activated. No big deal. Simply go around them. You don't even have to kill them. Well, destroy them, I mean. Unless you're looking for that trophy, the, uh, destroy the, uh, siege weapon trophy. You just come in here. There's a little Joshu up there. And just Musu and rage mode him. Screw it. There you go. Done. And there you have it, guys. If you guys enjoyed the gameplay commentary, be sure to leave a like. Leave your opinions in the comment section if you found this guide to be helpful. <clears throat> Other than that, thanks for watching, and I'm gonna leave the video off on this little clip, and you'll see for yourself that Dion Way just does not die at the end. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next Star Guide. See ya. That is quite the loaded question. The latter. I've lived my life for my talent, for my genius. I could have done more, but I have no regrets. Come, I'm ready. Do it. Very well then. Joshu, I ask that you use your talents in my service. Are you <clears throat> serious? Without Dian Wei, I would have certainly been dead. <laughs> It'd be a shame to waste such intellect. You fought most impressively, Dian Wei. 
You remind me of the legendary warriors of yore that I have read about. <laughs> 